Hi everybody, Prototype Jimmy and welcome to a quiet place, the road ahead. I'm sure some of you have probably seen this game. It's based on obviously the blockbuster films. I can't quite remember too much about the films. I think I have watched them but I ain't seen them for such a while. But obviously all I can really remember is the fact that the monsters can hear you and you have to be quiet. So I mean just look at this title screen. How eerie it is. In fact, it's not, no sound, just the wind. It's dead. That's just more eerie than anything. Ooh. Now I do have my mic set up, so I have tweaked the settings so I should be able to talk and it not uh, set them off so much but we'll see because it's just gauging it so we'll see how things go but I hope you enjoy and let's jump in and I hope I don't make too much noise mm -hmm. It's a leucistic white-tailed deer. Uh, Louis, what now? <laughs> leucistic means they have patches of white fur. Ah, uh, I, I thought that was called getting old. Okay, this is a huge deal. They're incredibly rare. <laughs> oh, I'd love some rare venison. Did you hear that? Hear what? Wait here. I'm gonna check it out. Martin, hold on. Martin! Uh-oh. Where the hell did he go? Deep crouch. Oh, I hate Seaver Crouch. It's so annoying. Look at this, this actually looks amazing. What do we think it's gonna come back? Be careful, you always watch your step. Different surfaces like water, dry leaves, grass, metal or debris can uh, produce a noise around the alert and nearby creatures. Okay. So how do we... Oh, here we go. Slow movements. When you can, can't can avoid noisy surfaces, walk slowly in the sound more slightly to walk, move slightly to walk through slower. Crazy, you can hear the differences between the sound. So much rustling. I know we're like in the wilderness, but damn. Just keep hearing things walking around the sides of me. Let's just say this looks amazing, by the way. Why? 
Uh oh. Hearing noises everywhere. Well, that's not just creepy, is it? I thought I'm going to be walking slowly everywhere. Okay. Even slowly makes so much noise in here. Well, we can see clearly going there because you can see the yellow marks. Jesus. Thank you, yellow marks. I have to move the door. Oh, it creaks. The more you move it quickly, the more it creaks. There's a can of WD-40 when you need one. The sounds of flies just means we need lots of... I'm walking slowly, but I'm still making so much noise. Scan. Dear Christ almighty. I mean, imagine how eerie this is. You cannot make an Jesus freaking can you can't make a noise or it's your pure end. That must be well hard to do. Especially when you need to get out, survive. I mean look for stuff. I haven't actually found anything yet that's God damn it, my book. Oh, you're a fucking child! Exactly. Oh, come on, come on. That was funny. No, it wasn't. You're five? Oh, just a minute. I got you pretty good. No. No, you didn't. I just... I didn't know where you were. I didn't know if you were hurt or... Uh, Alex. And, and I can't... I can't lose another... What's wrong? Alex, what's wrong? Oh, Jesus. Shit. <laughs> Hey, 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 what, what do you need? Huh? Alex, come on, come on. Please, please, please. Tell me how to help, okay? Martin, Mom? what is it? I, I don't know. She, she just... Alex, it's me. Can you tell she's having an asthma attack? Can you look at me, dear? Okay, that's it. Just look at me. And breathe. Breathe. There you go. Everything's going to be all right now. I mean, suffering from asthma myself. I kind of know what these symptoms are going on.
Great call signs there, boy. I must explore and find supplies. Let me know that. Now it sounds like rain and water streams and waterfalls can cover the sounds of you. Let us move safely. Right, so we can't get in there. It worked. I know I told you. I mean, not to try it, but damn it, Tom, it worked. Travelling to the waterfall about half a mile from here and snapped my fingers. Nothing, no creatures. Then I spoke a full volume for the first time, serious before the invasion. And still nothing. Finally, don't kill me, I yelled. And still no sign. Not a single creature. I mean, it's not a permanent solution, but at least we know loud noises will keep the creatures from hearing us. I told you, Tom. I freaking told you. I mean, that just proves that, you know, us go insane not being able to make loud noises. Have to be cautious of what you say. If you're frustrated or angry, you can't scream and shout. That's really get to you, I must mean. Oh, doors just wide open. Oh, so dark, man. It's in his money prints for a reason. I'll get there. Yep. So I can't remember the film, so I don't know if that's like kind of an Easter egg to the films or not. If you see anyone, tell Daddy. You can see documents that are found. And it's through the opening of the diary. Just J. Okie doke. Luckily for the minute, the mic's not kicking in, so... That made me jump. But leaves everywhere. Trying to avoid everything. We can't squeeze through there. There's got to be ways to get through the path then. Silence is safety. Thanks again for giving me Ash. But Mr. Rice, my freak of a teacher, took all of my classmates' phones so we could force on nature or some kind of shit. I thought there was no supposed to be any cool reception here anyway. So what the hell? And I thought, oh god, what is Sarah thinking? I don't want to text her. So then I thought, what if I just writ her a letter or something? And then I thought about Julie and how back in the 1700s she'd send a letter to all her lovers while she was 
off being a kiss ass opera star and having sword fights and stuff and it just seemed I don't know super romantic no no I'm expecting this to be romantic or not romantic or whatever uh, anyways I await your reply or not if this was a lot and you don't want to respond that's like totally cool no worries wow <laughs> Kinda of reminds me of the way I'm message. Guest room. I'm supposed. To, I'm guessing I'm supposed to go to the infirmary, but I'm to explore. Or not? Apparently, I can't explore. There's blockage. I mean, surely you'd be at, you'd be able to move that out of your way, but God, it's so eerie. All on a dirty brick road. All on a dirty brick road. Why is there all this stuff just left to here? Almost like people entered but didn't. Like leave? A damn kid stuck into my office again. I swear to God, he must have been getting into the office through the upstairs vent. And before you ask, yes, I am certain I locked the door. Now will you go check? There's a hint of where we got to go. To get into the office. Even though by the looks of it, someone's already been there. I mean, look at the destruction. I mean, I saw some marks on the wall. Let Dad get the medicine. I hear everything. Great. I mean, lucky for the minute, my mic's not right on, so I can talk as much as I want. Josh, don't make a noise. If you feel stuck, you can press have a hint or where to go in the next sort of a few seconds. The hint also tells you which key action you may have to perform progress through the sections. Okay. It's actually Sarah, but all good. And what the fuck are teachers even allowed to do that? Thank you for the beautiful letter. It gave me something to treasure. Why my mum made me go hiking and HFS. Not sure what I have. I love. I don't know what that says. My parents got me a biography about her from Christmas, and not so suited. You know, you, yeah, we know, and it's romantic as fuck doesn't that mean you like kill a noble to earn my entire devotion or something because I wasn't being good with flowers Sarah PS today we went your class was going horseback riding right and I'm okay how it went let me know God it shows how old I am 
Not too up to on any abbreviations. Locked. The block to there. Need a key. Oh, great. Guessing we'll go there, but locked. Need a screwdriver for that. And locked there. Well, that's where we go in. Through the hole for the wall. Man, I can't see nothing. Are we going out? Ah, oh, the old Shimmeroonie. Let me jump. <sighs> so it's going to be like this a lot, is it? What's that? What just appeared on the top left? Well, we know she's already asthmatic, so maybe that's got something to do with anxiety. Dear God. Don't tell me what to stop her from having panic attacks or something. Ooh, screwdriver. The screwdriver allows you to unscrew and enter the air ducts interact with them yep we can't go through that door does that mean I have to go back not there do we just jump can't just jump, so oh my god, then we have to go back. Tell me we just come all this way for a screwdriver. Wait, well, I can't get out of the window. Where have I got to go? Do I have to jump down? Remember hide and seek. I'll climb over this. Because that's up there. I mean, there's no yellow mark, so I can't jump down there. I'm up here. Right, that went yellow. God. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
keep spinning it round and round. Down, I have to go. That's pretty cool. Bonus credits. When you find a shiny shuttle, you earn a certain number of credits depending on its rarity. The rarity is expressed by its color. You can use these points to unlock additional content in the menu under the extras voice. Okay. Wait, so I can't get out there? I went the wrong way? Oh, maybe I did this way. Wait, 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 that's where I come from. No, 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 no. So I'll go right. It was on the upstairs, so yeah, we're going to go down. Makes sense. Now we're in the office. What's this? Can't get them? No? map oh so that's handy is that a motherboard no it's a stupid stomach bug thank god the rain is covering our noise This is killing me, and what's worse, I finished action pills that gave me. I hope to find some in the firmary, and I'll take this map with me. If the national grid is still there, maybe they can help supply the hospital. It could be just what we need. I'll show it to Martin. I'm sick of this. There's nothing really I can get in here. Oh, key. You're telling me I have all this stuff, there's nothing in here? I thought that statue was something then, I was like, oh my god. What? Oh my god, I have to do this. I mean, he's a cool mechanic, but still. <clears throat> Was this four, wasn't it?
wonderful that's five slowly does it oh my god I mean how how slow do you need to do it your ground creaks it's not ominous all this blood oh thank god I'm so glad that you like the letter and the book sounded amazing for Christmas. My parents got me a mug with my cat, Mr. T <laughs> Mr. Twinkles, based on it. Before it was hilarious. Me and Mr. Twinkles were not amused. Oh, and I knew you were like probably joking, but I picked this flowers for you. I hope it doesn't get crushed when I put it under your door. The front door said it was a candle on flower anyway I hope you like it uh, PS it wasn't bad I think the horse knew I was terrified because it threw me off after like five seconds that's when I went back and picked you know, that flower PPS I may pick a few more flowers tomorrow if you want to join after lunch So it just shows that literally, because you couldn't make no noise, people were just communicating through like written messages. It's pretty cool. You okay? My mum freaking out, saying something fell from the sky before. Poor safe. Let's rain trick the flowers. Picks okay. So was there messages before then? Maybe. Is that a vent? That's not a vent I can climb out of. Good old asthma pump. A pregnancy test? Ooh. In the world is uh, in a apocalyptic state, alien invasion. She's now pregnant. God, that must be a lot to think about. Nothing really more in there. That would just be hard to uh. 
Imagine having a baby in a world where you've got to be quiet. That's going to be difficult as hell. Being parented into a new state. In there. Oh, it literally leads you to here. I was going to see if we can get that chip in the kitchen. Maybe it's one of the things you have to do, like, on the next the turn. this music well that's a I mean that's a pretty good picture really considering little kid and his dad holding the gun what image that is my dad is the best better than the rest he keeps me safe all day he keeps the monsters away he tells me not to make you peep and protects me while I sleep so I can dream of mum because when I sleep she's not gone Oh, so cute and sad at the same time man say pictures I can describe a thousand words there she Josh I think that's Josh in it I done all the get any more candles oh here All the kids' drawings. Bless him. Poor kid. Is that all the candles? Oops. What's up, my man?
God bless you. Two happy dance. Psychological and mental stress that aggravates Alex's asthma. Her condition is spurny, but the stress icon on the top left of the screen when Alex's stress becomes critical, she will suffer an asthma attack. Try to keep the asthma stress to a low level by using an inhaler or pills. When the stress level is high, you can. Lead to the asthma attack. Avoid it by pressing F. With a green result, the asthma stress is reduced. With a yellow result, you avoid the crisis. With a red. Oops, sorry. But yeah, with the yeah, you avoid grammar, but you're still one step away from it. With a red, you will have an attack. Great. Extra nailer. What should we do? Yeah, we'll figure it out. When it cries, laughs. We'll keep it safe. I don't know, but, but we will. And your mom? She'll be a grandmother. Laura hates me ever since. You saved me that day. I'll be on my struggle Alex. with him. Uh... Finally, something good. Trying to hit them asthma things. Oh, God. Especially if I messed up the test. Will the hospital have them? No, we're low on everything. There's a camp. They'll have supplies. Alright, first we bring food back to the hospital, then we'll go to the camp. Yeah, good. My mic is still not kicking in. Read the diary. Mine is amazing. I won't say it. I'm not scared anymore. But knowing him, he will give me the strength. I'm still not. I don't know about how I will react, but it's her grandchild will talk about it for God's sake. She should be happy, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> Little and crosses. Glass. <laughs> Things you gotta do, I suppose, for passing the time.
Can I go explore? There's so still that ship I'll get to. How do I even get to that? No, it forces you to go that way. Damn it. I had one chance to get that and I messed up. Somehow. Slowly does it. Damn, that just took him straight out. Someone tell me how hollow was that tree? Alex, how's it going? Any uh, progress with the um... phenometer? Phenometer. Right. You get it working? No. You need something? Oh, I'm heading to rations. Care to join me? No. No thanks, Dad. Okay. And how about, uh, how about I help you with the phenometer? I'm no tech wizard, but... Dad, no, it's not ready. I know, Alex. I know. I'm a doctor. And your father. How far along? Uh, I don't... Two months, maybe? Who else knows? I... told Martin before he... <laughs> Alex, you will get through this. We will all get you through this. Me, Laura... No, Laura can't find out. Why? You really want to tell her I'm pregnant with her grandchild? Laura's always at her best when she has a goal. Since Martin's death, Mark's been running things, which is bad for everyone. This could give her something to focus on, besides her, her grief. She will never forgive me. Never. Well, she's going to find out whether or not we tell her. Not, not if we leave. Leave? There's... A campsite turned into a National Guard outpost. They've got supplies. Well, we are not going anywhere. This pregnancy will be complicated. I can take care of you here. At a half burned down hospital out of supplies. Have you actually spoken to anyone at this camp? No, but... So we don't even know if the National Guard is still there. I'll... I'll find proof. No. You need to rest. Dad, please. Look. I'll find proof. Tomorrow I'll look for a radio and see if I can reach someone. And if the National Guard is at the camp? One step at a time. All right? You shouldn't have a dead flashlight. I'll get you a battery. No, I'll get it. Are there any nausea pills? Antimedics? I'm not sure. Someone broke into the medicine cabinet. Now Mark won't let anyone near it. Okay. I'll collect what I can, so we're ready to leave once you contact the camp. Just... Be careful.
much going on. Happy one month anniversary. I know it's super cheesy to celebrate being together for a month. But in this world, I'd say one month is quite an accomplishment. I love you, Martin. One waterfall retreat where you'll be able to sing as much as you want. I owe you, bless. I don't know what to say, but I'm here. Dad. Obviously, Dad knew he's the first person I've told ever since mine died since that day slash out also told him about the national grid outpost at the campsite he wants to help me knowing him on my side knowing he's on my side this is the only thing keeping me going i got to get ready to leave this death trap bag pills battery the phenomena and a torch So I'm guessing I'll get that stuff ready. Was this? Oh, come on. Is that a picture of her mum? I can't interact with that vent. I mean, do I need to be quiet? I'll let her hear. Hell above. How hell actually comes from above. Not down below. Fell from the sky, slash the day laugh. The dead hook. Best friend, how dogs couldn't have survived in invasion because they wanted to protect their owners. Man's best friend, slash till the very end. Too sad. Yes chance to scream how the one thing you want to do is the one thing you absolutely can't when only scream slash when i dream <coughs> last song song about being the last song any human ever wrote narrated known that singing it will be her death so no one will ever get to hear the whole thing but still wants to sing it anyway and now i see slash sing song is just for me slash yeah <laughs> this song is just for me what the fuck am i doing i never get to write music for any of these stupid songs anyway it must be hard that you can't like sing dance then when they're kids i'm guessing just a second that it that's all it took, dragging away, hunt like hunting look. Can't turn back time, what do what's done is done, and I'm the one who held the gun. Moments come, moments pass. Oh so urgent, not built to last. I'm fragile, so when I'm dreaming I hear his cries. Gone so fast, no goodbyes. I pay it back inside my head. What's said is said, what's dead is dead. Moments come, moments pass. We're so fragile, not built to last. Oh, damn. So morbid. I suppose at this time, I suppose it would be. This is his room. And right between me and Martin, I wrote in blue ink, Martin wrote in red ink. <coughs> Don't know it was the last time we'd be in the, my room together. So, what, we're doing this. I uh, thought Lana forbid you. She also forbids me from dating you. That wasn't a matter of life or death. Oh, I beg to differ. I don't know, the only place in, in miles we haven't looked for food in is the ranch. Yeah, we wouldn't have looked because raiders were spotted there weeks ago still. What's the point of sitting here s scared when we could actually do something good? Okay. So clearly he wanted to go and she didn't. 
posters of many places. Don't know if there's places where they've been or places to go. Do it now. Picture of a singer. I love you, duh. Nothing's going to change that. But you can't, but I need you to. But I'm asking you to do something for me. Not being so go easy on Alex. Ever since the invasion, you've made her feel like shit. Treat her like crap. Made her feel even worse about what happened. I think she isn't beating herself up already. Or you think she isn't. You think she isn't crying that guilt as she is this morning she said that she wished it was it had been her instead you have no idea how fucked up this is and you're acting like you wish the same thing and that's fucked up not okay if she had taken the shot done what she did what did you think would have happened to me she saved me and dad made his choice would have wanted her to do to do what he thought was <coughs> clearly here when he was a uh, mum having spouts red button both locked Administration locked. Damn it, Mark, I didn't steal any pills. Well, someone did. Yeah, probably the Watsons. Or anyone else who was smart enough to get the hell out of here. No one is leaving until I find out who did this. I'm searching every including yours. You've gone off the deep end without Laura pulling on your leash. Watch it. Check, check what you want. I didn't take anything. Big one's getting it in each other's throats. Those things are going missing. As when survival is uh, happening, everything is uh, vital. Rations have been cut in half. This is certainly uh, not up to discussion. Mark. So clearly, things are getting low. Everyone's struggling. Baby, I know you're hungry, but you can't make a noise. Have the rest of the mine. Okay, Mum and Daddy will get you more soon, I promise. So, yeah, everyone's struggling with rations. Storage room. So, yeah, I was guessing, like, we don't know how far like things have gone. I suppose everyone's be fighting for like rations, medication. Kind of makes you wonder what it'd be like, really, doesn't it? Like they talk about raiders group of people just run around probably just taking what they want I mean am I supposed to go in there I can go in there locked Half of these are probably like still not. So 
Someone broke into the medical cabinet and stole from us. If you know anything about this, you must tell me immediately. Fail to do so fail means failing to put your community first. I mean, it's not even locked. This area's off limits. Right, sorry. I, I just heard someone got into the pills and I was worried. But I'll go. Exactly what I was thinking. You can find different types of items around the world. You can store or equip them whenever you want. Use Q for tools and E to consume. You can also use see key items useful for the progress in the top right of the screen. I have a flashlight. Mark caught me taking stuff from the storage room, then left with a strange smile. That psycho gives me the creeps. He's out of control, especially now. Uh, Lana's stopped running things. One more reason to leave, speak of. I should finish the phenomenon with the thermometer. The thermometer. It could save our skins out there. Food. I'll go there. I mean, how do I? Let's confirm pills. Ah, here we go. Toggle light. Not really tall, like you just push it down. Recharge it. R. Call out by pressing Alt button. You can also choose to show or hide them completely in the settings. One's praying. Light candle. I really need my torch out at the precise moment in time. I know there has been concerns about my decisions to mission already to decommission all radio phones and any devices that will be allowed to communicate with the outside world. Please allow me to explain, although it has only been a month since the invasion, so it's been a month. Right. 
it's become abundantly clear that arranging people to come together in large groups is almost a certain a death wish look at what happened here when the invasion began hundreds of people filled these halls screaming and begging for help and all it did was lead all these creatures straight to us how many of our friends and families were wiped out by these things or taken by the fire that enraged with the west wing or because they were too many of us to put me in charge of our community for a reason trust my judgment I will not let you down Lorna I mean it makes sense really a large group of people is just gonna make things ten times worse indoor Pump, that's good. Wait, we found that in the men's toilets? Crazy. Who's that guy? Looks like some biker. So I'm guessing we'll go back. and save my battery as much as can I'll go this way really I don't think that would stop much from getting through If you see debris on the ground, broken glass, etc., it must be cleared up immediately. Stepping on noisy surfaces will alert the creatures to your location. This cannot happen. So they're going to some great lengths to just stay alive. Somebody put sand on the floors, I'm guessing, to soften the your noise. I mean, it makes sense, really. Go through people's stuff. Never get how Julie was twisted her hair between her thumbs and forefingers when she was thinking and the way she rolled her shoulders whenever she yawned. Translation of espresso. Espresso? I was in floor whenever I said that I'd be ready in five minutes her fingernails grazing my palm as we held her hands her smile while we calling me a nerd how hard she gripped my hand while watching Alex graduate high school when she said I never I'm never doing that again after giving birth to Alex the first time she Held Alex, her favourite words were dwelt. The weight of her head resting on my shoulders, the time about the taming of suits. The way even a bad production of Romeo and Juliet would make her cry when she stormed upstairs to take a bath whenever she was angry. 
and then we'll attempt to make Alex a musical themed cake for our 10th birthday all the stupid note look like question marks <laughs> she went her shiver when she kissed her neck okay move the drawer and if you're good in here Nothing. Map. So I guess that's a dad's room. Alex. A big ass screwdriver for that then parts. Surely you need a small one. I think you should have that out. Not fall asleep with it with your hand, Jesus. So advice, you don't want someone to know something, don't leave it lying out. How long? Laura? What are you? How long have you known? I... I will not let you hurt another member of my family. Laura, wait. I suppose her husband's died, her son's died. Won't be your prisoner. Well, looks like we're going. Hey, I couldn't sleep last night, so instead I put together a list of potential baby names. All to totally just a Bonnie, all touch your jizz, so feel free to circle any that like and cross out any you hate. What do you think of a child will be like? I like to imagine they have the eyes and your eyes and my chin, your smile and my hair, your creative your creativeness and my sense of humour. Although as long as they did didn't inherit my dad's laugh, I'll be happy. <coughs> or who am I kidding? I'll be happy no matter what. They could be exactly like you or nothing like either of us. And it wouldn't matter. The kid is going to get sick and tired of how much we will love them. Oh wait, surnames. What do you want, want to do for surnames? I'm down to combine our last names. So Taylor Edwards, Edward Taylor. I'll do what? Or do you want to do something really wild? And squeeze it down together to Taywood. <laughs> we get our sister to that. Okay, so names like I'd like. I include girls' names, boys' names, gender neutral names, because hey, a good name's a good name. And at that point at some point they might want to change their name anyways, which is called to Evelyn. My grandmother's name was Evelyn. I never got to meet her. She died when my mum was pregnant with her. But I've heard a lot about her and it means a lot to my mother. Julie, for obvious reasons, your mum was one of the warmest people I've ever met while being in good shape. If I could, is half as kind. Devon, 
name of a kid who shared his juice box with me once legend <laughs> that's it that's all you need share a juice box a homage alan a homage a homage to my favorite writer that isn't a dork as ed dorky or edge edger or good for forbidden poem madison Selfishly, every time our kid gets angry, I want a chance to say the quality dad joke, man, that really put the mad in Madison. Maven. I've always liked the name Maven. I feel like it depends find someone to have a bug's hawks and spray paint stand on their fingerprints. Fingertips. Okay. Anyway, that's what I get got for now. Let me know which ones you like, which ones you hate, and feel free to add all the suggestions below. By the time our kid actually gets here, we'll have probably considered every name under the sun, which I am more than okay with. Bless. Never forgive me for what I did to her family, and now she knows that I'm expecting her grandchild. But locking me inside my room? I'm sorry, Martin. I know she was your mother, but I wasn't spent my life in prison because she can't trust me. I ain't gonna be no damn... Ah, fucking screwing... I mean, everything makes noises. I mean, is that a faster way of doing it? You were right. It's not safe here. I knew Laura was upset, but I never thought she'd lock you up. Grab your things. I'm getting you out of here. Okay. The device. He's just hiding there. Oh dear Christ. Inhaler and pills. Inhaler and pills are used to lower your stress levels, avoiding asthma attacks. And pills are consumed the moment you collect them and they manage to lower and small potential stress. The inhaler can be complete, 
kept as a consumable and when it's used completely removes stress and gives a temporary immunity God, they got him quick, didn't it? The phenomenon shows the noise Alex is making in relation to the environment sounds around her. Be quieter than the environment, but remember, tape, wire, and wits make up an experiment, not a professional tool. Every noise is dangerous. Try to reduce the sound as much as possible by avoiding noisy surfaces or walking slowly on them and hitting objects such as metal barriers and cans. Try to keep everything you do under the environment sound level. Dear God. It's going to be crazy. I haven't even checked what the mic's going to be like yet. I'm going to be dead. Call it now. I'm going to be dead. Just going to sit on that screen for a sec. Because I need to uh, chill. I'm sorry if I don't talk as much. We'll try and talk, but I thought when you talk it would have a level bar. Kind of similar to uh, I mean, page and a core, like a level of like the noise, but it doesn't, it just tells you when your mic's on. I don't know if it will come up on this machine, but dear god, it's gonna be crazy. I'm even worried where I'm putting my drink. Don't want to make a noise.
Jesus. I'm guessing there's some sort of leeway. Scary. I don't know if sitting in your journal keeps you safe, but my god, man. It's actually terrifying.
I was doing the screws and I was like, am I making too much noise? I don't know. But it looks like you've got some sort of leeway because I've made some loud noises and they've not chased me. But it's still early days. But we'll have to see. I'll have to check out speaking as well, see if that, uh, how far that affects it, but we'll see. Every inch of his hospital for food, even the wigs <coughs> scorched during the fire. So I'm not going to hate myself, I need help. And I'm going to help, I need to search outside this hospital, blah blah blah. It does affect it a bit, but not too much, luckily. I hope you can hear me properly. say because everything is fine a couple of people have left the hospital but that's good it means who remains are actually committed to our community just keeping resting I've got this Let me just double check that. No. That's a bit unrealistic, I think. I know for a fact that you can... I suppose for game logic, you suppose that makes sense, but... can't imagine what you're feeling if you need anything I'm here and I know it's not my place to say but be careful with trusting Mark as I've asked Kenneth that made me jump
Inhale. Kind of a shame I wasted my... Inhaler, um, like I've got some pills. Awareness. If you make too much sounds, you will trigger the creature that will search for you. You can understand when this happens by hearing the sound cue. If so, get out of there and avoid any noises until you feel the danger has gone away. Okay. So, yeah, there is some sort of... <coughs> What's the word? leeway then it's going to pounce on you Noise detection. For more intense experience, the game includes a noise detection mode which will track every sound your microphone can capture. And if if it's made by Alex, and the microphone detects a noise and reduces it in game, and the microphone con will show it. In some sections, the microphone detection will be deactivated and it will be shown with a Barriered icon, microphone icon. You can enable the noise detection mode and collaborate your microphone with the gameplay and the options, which I've already done. I did tweak it a little, so hopefully it won't pick up massive sounds. So I will be talking to you normally, hopefully, and it shouldn't be so much loud that it's making noise. But we will see. Who knows if I fart or sneeze or some other thing. I couldn't help with some monsters coming after me. But we will see. nothing I could do I literally had to move out of the way quickly god damn it I suppose being slow it can also get you killed as well We 
Yeah, we know about the can. On the headphones. literally follows you. No! And you've got nothing to distract you? Jesus Christ, game. Give me something. Something to froze. Something to do. Come on. Not sure how I'm going to do this, but... Battery will run out, and what happens? Charge batteries. Use it again. I kind of wish I had something to throw. Wonder if I can wait and see if it'll come. You do. It's a bit difficult. This arm takes out the whole of the area. I couldn't go back.
true we don't have enough supplies to have a Winston's. Anyone who asks, we've got to be smart about it. Who's being volunteered to go on the hunt? Crazy. Trying to get out of here. be as quiet as possible.
everything you do it makes a noise. I'll just try and be so quiet. It's actually terrifying. The door makes so much noise. If and I are leaving, you know why I'm generally sorry, but we'll give that roof on in charge. Soon there will be no hospital to salvage. All our love to you and Alex.
Here we go. Basically, sometimes they might be in a situation where you need to pass through the creature to go to the next objective. Keep your distance. Don't make a sound and find your way. Great. Good one. So what you're telling me is I've got to try and maneuver around it while it's wandering about and make no noise.
I'm going to call that app for today. I'm going to call that app for today. God, that was stressful. Oh my god. Trying to be quiet. I mean, luckily I tweaked the settings, so it's, when I'm talking, it's not as loud as what it is for OBS than what it is for me in the game. But still, it's nerve wracking. Anyway, I hope you like it. Give it a like and a comment if you do. I hope to see you on the next episode. Goodbye.